North Korea tells US to prepare for final doom as Kim threatens to annihilate Trump. S regime sent a chilling warning shot to the US president telling him it is prepared to annihilate the US imperialists, the ringleader of aggression, to the last man on this planet. The secretive state said America will never escape the fate of getting scorched by the fire of justice after President Trump threatened to totally destroy during his first UN Assembly address. The warning, pumped out by the communist state's propaganda machine, is the latest escalation by North Korea in threats of nuclear war against the US. It comes as Mr. Trump today said he is prepared to take military action to end tensions with Pyongyang and the results would be devastating. Describing Mr. Trump as a mentally deranged hooligan, North Korea said action is the best option in treating the dotard. Pyongyang's mouthpiece Korean Central News Agency, KCNA, said, the DPRK solemnly warned that the way out for the US to evade its final doom is to think with discretion and roll back its anachronistic cost of policy toward the DPRK, though belatedly. Action is the best option in treating the daughter who, hard of hearing, is uttering only what he wants to say. Such maniacs as Trump who are fond of war should be tamed only with fire. Whatever they might have expected, they will face results beyond their expectation. Hinting that the nuclear bomb could be dropped on mainland America, KCNA said, the impudent aggressors US imperialists have so far ignited wars against other countries and nations and inflicted all kinds of disasters upon them and have resorted to a nuclear blackmail against the DPRK and the world calculating that there is no bomb that can be dropped on their land. They should clearly understand that tremendous is the power of the army and people who formed a citadel around their leader and turned out as one and that no one can break the decision and will of the DPRK to fully exercise the right to preemptive strike to defend the dignity of the supreme headquarters and sovereignty. How far and vast the US land may be, it can never escape the fate of getting scorched by the fire of justice of the DPRK. Yesterday North Korean Foreign Minister Ri Yong-ho accused Mr Trump of declaring war on the North and threatened to shoot down US warplanes flying near the Korean peninsula. Last weekend American bombers flew the closest they ever have to the country. North Korea's sixth and most powerful nuclear missile test was carried out on September 3rd when Kim's regime tested a hydrogen bomb. KCNA said, belated regret for a wrong judgment and action at a wrong time would be useless. It is the stern determination and will of the DPRK to annihilate the US imperialists, the ringleader of aggression, to the last man on this planet.